Hi everybody, Jim Bell here. Welcome to this tutorial. What I'm going to show you today in this video is how to make a big picture out of a small one. Now yes, you can crop sizes up and down in Photoshop, but that is not really a good way to do it. We could use image size, as in here, and uh, change the size and do it that way. And we will show you that. If one okays that, you would get quite a big size. And that's not bad. But as you can see, it starts to pixelate. So let's let's actually enlarge this now. And go up to image size. And we change this 10 inch. 40 inch, which and automatically turns the other one into 30. We're going to leave it at by cubic, and uh, but you can experiment and try the others and see what you think. Now there's a little bit of noise there, not a lot, but a little bit. Now this is a massive picture. I mean, you're talking 33, 35 megabytes. So I'm going to undo that. I'm going to show you the way I would I prefer to do it. Now I go up to File, Automate, down to Genuine Fractals, which is a plugin for Photoshop, and it's very good. Now this is the little dialog box that comes up. Now we change the 10 to 30, and it changes the 40 rather, and it changes the one underneath to 30, and then we click OK. And once it starts, it takes a little while, but I edit out the time so we don't have waste time sitting there watching the little blue line go across. I have to let you show you a little bit. And there's a slight improvement on the noise. And if we enlarge the area and see what it uh, shows, it shows there that's two and that's one hundred percent. Now we're going to enlarge it up to five hundred percent to show you how good this is. No pixelation at all, really, that you can speak of there. And that's 500%. And there you go. Thank you for watching.